Conditions were windy today in San Jose for the Get Sports Focus Baseball Game of the Week. It was the Bellarmine Bells taking on the St. Francis Lancers at home in WCL play. Wes Harper starting on the hill for Bellarmine, Brandon Oliver for St. Francis. Slow start for these two teams, 0-0 coming into the fourth inning. St. Francis with two hits, Bellarmine with one. Bases loaded for the Lancers after Harper beans two batters in a row. Josh Lauk at the plate for St. Francis and he'll smack a line drive down center field. The Lancers will score three runs as a result and finish the inning with a 3-0 lead. Bellarmine's Lawrence Palmer with a single for the Bells in the bottom of the fourth. Here's Palmer again, this time sliding to steal second off of a miscue between Brandon Oliver and Ryan Jeffries. Same inning, Harper at bat, down two outs. He'll send this one to far left field where Ryan Higgins will get an assist from the wind and catch Harper out, and a close call for the Lancers. We now go to the sixth inning. Josh Lauk at bat for the Lancers. He'll make nice contact and pop the ball up into the outfield, sacrificing an out for a Ryan Higgins run and a 4-0 lead in the top of the sixth. Bottom of the sixth and we're beginning to see some Bellarmine momentum. Lawrence Palmer starts things off with this single, followed by a double by Matthew Cowell. Harper's hit and subsequent out was enough for Palmer to reach home base and the Bells cut the St. Francis lead to three. To end the sixth inning, it's St. Francis up four to three over Bellarmine. The Lancers with two outs in the top of the seventh. Ryan Higgins down 0-2 in the count launches a beauty towards the right side of the outfield. Nobody from Bellarmine in the immediate vicinity, and Troy Siegler's free to dash home, running on behalf of Mac Chelly. St. Francis leads 5-3 going into the bottom of the seventh. It's Connor Mack with a perfectly placed hit to apply even more pressure to the Lancers. His double will put him on second and Cal on third. Lawrence Palmer walked to load the bases for the Bells. Todd Jackson batting for Bellarmine, and he cracks this one down the left side of the diamond for two Bellarmine runs in a tie ball game. Henriquez's ground ball is tossed to second. Check out the game-changing double play from Chelly to Jeffries to stifle a two-run inning for the Bells and force extra innings. From there, it took four more innings for the Lancers to squeak out a one-point victory on hits from Matt Chelly, a sack fly from Daniel Idens, and lights out pitching from JT Folan. With the win, St. Francis improves to 9-3 on the season. They'll take on the Sarah Padres at home next Tuesday. Game of the Week is brought to you by Top Flight Elite Baseball and by Ike's Lovin' Sandwiches. Championship-level sandwiches every time. Daniel Idens. We're going to award you with the Ike's gift certificate, so enjoy that sandwich for yourself. And also a couple questions for you personally, Daniel. How did it feel to go 11 innings deep with the Bellarmine Bells? What was it like in those uh, last couple minutes of the game, closing it out, getting it done, three and a half hours past the starting time for this game? I mean, it was a long one. Uh, it was spent, uh, cramping up a little bit, but, uh, but we kept grinding, we kept going, and it came through, so, yeah. So, uh, what part of the game plan today do you think click back best for you guys uh, was it fielding pitching batting or just the whole package I think the whole package I mean our defense is great our offense came through in the end so I think all of it was great 
No separate. And what's it like to come out here today and get a big win in the Holy War against you guys' rivals, the Bellarmine Bell? I mean, it was great, and it wasn't just me, it was these guys. So. Hey. Hey. All right, well, thank you so much for the interview, Daniel. Have a great day yourself, and of course, good luck in your next WCL matchup. We'll give you the Get Sports Focus Playmaker shirt. And the next man that I want to talk to is the Get Sports Focus Baseball Game of the Week MVP. Can I please get Josh Lauk in the middle? Josh, first off, here's your Ike's gift card. And now we get to the questions. What was it like for you personally coming out today and doing battle with the team and the WCAL like the Bellarmine Bells? Uh, it's always great playing the Bells, um, great rivalry. We all have friends on the team. It's great to compete against them, and we came through, and it's awesome. Great feeling. And how does it feel to get the win, especially so late at night? I mean, the sun's already set. You guys <laughs> win 11 innings into the game, uh, you win the extra innings. What would you attribute that to in your team's game plan? Uh, just like Daniel said, everything was perfect. Hitting, fielding, our outfield is great, tracking down balls. Daniel, Garrett catching balls in the gaps, and Higgins throwing people out a second. It's, it's all clutch. It's all right, and final question. You guys have a long season in front of you guys. Um, what are the plans do you guys expect to go to uh, CCS, NorCal's, even State? What are the plans as far as that goes? Two words, 3P. We're looking for CCS. Yeah. Well, you guys have heard it. Get your Get Sports Focus MVP a shirt for the game of the week. Go Ducks! Ladies and gentlemen, can I get one last break before we send this one off? Let's go, let's go, three, one, two, three. Let's go. Yeah.